Hey, yo, it's Danny. Welcome back to the channel. Look, I just want to hop on here. Thank you for participating in the Witch Watch Wednesday. We will talk about the loser, but it doesn't really matter. We got an overwhelming vote for the um, Gravity Master. I'm gonna lie, we made a pretty good choice. We've been rocking the Seiko um, Sport 5 for about two weeks now. I know. You're gonna hold me. It was my fault. It's been a couple of weeks since I updated you on. Um, What we've been doing but we're back and we're here and we're changing out our watch to the scrabby master really excited about it i did it i did this watch actually twice and um you know it lost i think it lost to the calendar that was pretty crazy but we can bring it back for another round and it did pretty good but i ain't gonna lie like I said before, I'm not surprised that it lost to this watch, but I don't know. Comment down below. Why? Why did you guys not like this watch? It's solar powered. It has a compass. It has a barometer, altitude, pretty hardcore. In fact, I remember when this first came out, this was so expensive. And I was so proud to have it in the military. This was like one of my favorite watches to wear. But it lost, so it doesn't matter. We have a new winner. We are now gonna go ahead and release the Sport 5. I might be tanned up. All right. Wait, what the hell was that? Oh. Wow. Oh, okay. Wait, hold on. Oh, then I don't know what happened. Then I don't know what happened. Um, doesn't matter. We are here now. We released the Seiko. It's supposed to look like a Rolex, I guess. Is it a Daytona? Day date. One day. One day we'll get there. Rolex, if you're watching this video, I'll let your boy. Send me one of them. Matter of fact, anyone who have one, send it to me. I don't know what I'm going to do with it after I get it, but you probably ain't going to get it back. <laughs> so don't, if you send it, it's a one-way trip. You got to remember that. Now we're going to put on our, uh, our Gravity Master. Nothing special about this watch. Other than the gravity-defying display they have here. Right? Am I right? Am I right, camera? Yeah, I'm right. All right, let's go, let's go. I'm there. We're going to be rocking this for a whole week. Listen, I don't have the watch that I'm going to be putting up to replace like the new pole. So make sure you turn your notification and you're subscribed so you can see that. Oh, this is too tight. This is too tight. Good God. Good God. It's too yeah, make sure you turn on your notification. I hope this is the right time too. Yeah, we're close enough. We're close enough to be early. I'm not going to fix that. It's way too early. It's a whole hour ahead of time. Um, Man. That's why you gotta like them digital watches because they do it for you. I'm gonna bring this watch back. So y'all y'all stay on the lookout. It's gotta be something. You can't hate this watch that much. Anyway, we now rocking the Gravity Master. That's all it is. This is a short video just to show you that we are actually wearing it. You know, look out for that. Make sure you're on Instagram. I'm gonna start posting on there again for some reason. I don't know why I stopped. Oh, because Instagram sucks. I don't know why I stopped, but uh, we're gonna start posting there again. And um, yeah, that's it. That's really it. We're going to have the watches posted later on today. So stay on the lookout. It's probably going to be two G-Shocks. The metal bracelets are cool and all, but in the winter, it's cold, man. And um, if you're outside, it's just kind of uncomfortable. Yeah, I'm lying. I don't know. Just try to mix it up. And I'm, as you can see, I got like hairy arms. Hairy arms. So that metal bracelet be doing a real number on the, on the old follicles when it comes to some time when you're wearing them also also before you go you know if you made it this long we are still looking at so we're gonna do the knives thing now um as you know we have a quite we got a moderately healthy collection of knives so we're gonna start talking about um knives we're gonna start doing which knife we're gonna carry with our edc 
making sure it's for too long. <laughs> Get in trouble. <laughs> anyway, we're going to start talking about which knives we're going to carry. We've been carrying... Well, I've been carrying the bailout and indiscriminately and quite prejudicedly loving it. But um, I think it's time that the action is a little bit too loose. I've been using it so much. God, look at that speed. I've been using this so much. You go ahead. Anyway, I've been, I've been using this for so long that I forgot I have other ones. So now this one clearly blew it out the water. So we're going to put this up against something else and see how well it fares. And then I'll carry that. But, you know, maybe Monday. Seven days from when I posted the, the um, poll is when I'm going to change out this um, this knife. Are you excited? Why is it not focusing? Are you are you excited about this? You should be. It's gonna be dope. Anyway, that's all I have for you. Make sure you subscribe. Make sure you turn on notification. Make sure you're following the page. Make sure you're doing all of those things that you do to help us keep it 100. I'm not doing gang signs, but 100. 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10. And that's it. Anyway, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please remember to turn on your notification, subscribe. I can't say that enough because, you know, we're weird. Anyway, see you on the next one. One.